And so here I am, Kelly Canoss, Dudelsheim, Germany. The Reformed Church that our ancestors worshipped in. You know, Peter Canoss worshipped here, and his son, Johann Ludwig Canoss, born 1685. Also baptized the year he was born, 1685, in this church, Reformed Church of Dudelsheim. The right section of this church is the original part of the church. The left section is a, is a little bit uh, newer, but still uh, very historic. To our left, we have a, a memorial to uh, soldiers who lost their lives in World War One and Two. Several Knosses are, are remembered on the stone tablets behind the statue. You understand I probably had a hard time sleeping last night because our bed and breakfast is here, the gray building. Uh, the Pension is only just a few yards from uh, the church, the Reformed Church in Dudelsheim. Also interesting, the uh, Saint Winfred Boniface, Boniface, who I studied in um, church history, he took a pilgrimage and came through this route. And so people who want to uh, follow his route, Winfred Boniface, you can also come here. He was the apostle to the Germanic tribes. And so he has a route here, and sometimes people stop here at the Pension on their uh, journey or pilgrimage to Winfred Boniface's um, uh, path. And so there we have it. It's just like sacred ground. I can't believe it. That um, from 1535, all the Peter and Lucas and Peter and um, Johann worshipped here and then eventually uh, Johann Ludwig gathered his family and moved to America 1723. I believe his son is Sebastian Canoss and we're gathering information. Many Canosses come here to Dudelsheim to search their history and they come to this church and we're gathering information and just very excited to meet many Canosses here. Um, there's a graveyard behind us and there's several Canosses gravestones but they're recent um, every 25 years they have to replace um, the gravestones and the um, remains to make room for others since it's a very small cemetery in Dudelsheim, uh, Germany. Budingen would be the heart of the city. We went there last night. It's a very medieval town. Old, 1400s, 1500s, 1700s. Uh, absolutely incredible. Hopefully someday I can come back to this for my kids.